I finally caved because I saw so many people on Pinterest wearing them. My mom totally judged me for getting this. It's so, so soft. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be bringing you guys a Brandy Melville haul and try on. I'm going to be reviewing Brandy Melville's late summer to early fall kind of collection. I'm showing you guys what they have in stock, how it fits me, and giving my honest opinion about every single piece. Brandy Melville is known for their little tiny tank tops and t-shirts. Even though we are transitioning into fall, they did have quite a few of those in stock, so of course I had to pick one up. I like twisted the strap, <laughs> but anyways. I don't know what this tank top is called, the name will be on the screen. Light sky baby blue tank top with a white outlining and a little white bow. And this gives me kind of 90s vibes and I like that it's not super cropped. We're gonna move on to the top section of the video. I just have this white button down Caroline top. I got this specifically so I could wear it underneath crew necks and stuff like that because that is so like trendy and Pinteresty and stuff like that. Um, I think collars will definitely be a big fall trend. The next top I got is, okay, my mom totally judged me for getting this, but it is a oversized t-shirt that just has Bugs Bunny on it. It was $28, so a little bit overpriced if I'm being honest. It's not too bad like compared to other places that sell similar items. So now we're going to move on to outerwear. So we have this super, super cute oversized London shirt, or crew neck I meant. Like I said, it just says London and a navy with a white outlining, and the inside material is so, so soft. Elizabeth button down cardigan, and my middle name is Elizabeth, so that's kind of cool. Cardigan, it's kind of like an argyle gray, white, and black print. I've this next piece is very light pink. It's barely picking up on camera. It might be the Leslie cardigan or sweater, I guess. Um, it's just a light pink kind of v-neck knitted top. I'm going to be showing you guys the shorts that I got. A pair of light blue shorts with a little white stripe. They're like loungy shorts. Definitely going to be wearing these in online school. Um, but they kind of match the color of the tank earlier, but they just say Hawaii in the corner. The next pair of shorts, honestly, I used to totally like dislike these shorts. I would be like, oh, those shorts are so ugly. I would never want to wear those. I mean, who knows? When I put them on, I could feel the same way and then go return them. But I finally caved because I saw so many people on Pinterest wearing them. They are black biker shorts. Okay, I know you guys are going to judge me. Like, I know everyone's going to judge me. Um, hey, I love you. So, the last few things in the video are accessories. So they all come in these little bags, which I think are really cute. So this necklace was actually the last one in the store. I pulled it off of a mannequin to get it. And the workers are really nice. They're like, oh yeah, go ahead and just grab it off the mannequin. So I'll be like, okay, I'll go ahead then. Um, but it's a little more expensive than most of the Brandy Muffle jewelry. If you guys know, it's pretty inexpensive, but it's a little bit hard to show. It seems like pretty good quality and it's really, really pretty. So the other two items I got are earrings and they're both gold. So first, I picked up these star little um, huggy hoop earrings. Just look like that. These $4 little gold tiny little hoops that I think would look perfect in my second piercing. Also picked up some more postcards to hang in my room. Um, and I don't know if every location is doing this, but if you go to the store, you probably can get some of these postcards for free to decorate your room with or something like that. That's all for this video. Thank you guys for watching again, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye. We've been dancing for so long under the stars. I feel that the grass will